If you don't mind, can you like this video just one time? Today, I actually wanted to come to you with a couple tips. A couple tips to help you overall. Now, in this game, we're down just a bit. They just secured Baron. We're trying to defend, right? Stop throwing when you have Baron. It's so easy. Just don't do it. Here's a couple tips. One, you see us, right? We're, we're up here enjoying ourselves. That Lee was a little out of position. I hated him the whole time, right? You have to time it perfectly. When you are pushing down turrets and inhibs and the enemy is defending like we are here, you have to be so careful. They're just waiting for you. They're waiting for that slip up. And it's a lot easier to slip up on the offensive than it is on the defensive because we know where we're at. We're so much closer to health. We can heal ourselves. We can back and be back in the fight before you know it. Even if you are 10 and 0 and you think that you can do something, you can't. You cannot 1v8 us. It's not possible. Now, this Jax makes a horrible decision. My Morgana gets a great Q and exhausts him. Lee Sin kicks him. It's basically over. Here, this Jax has been bothering us, so I actually ulted him because I knew that the Nidalee and him could definitely get it back in this. Rather than facing their enemy team, I knew that Nidalee would be harassing us with these spears, so I broke off and decided to engage her. You'll actually see the troll throw one of her gay-ass spears. Anyway, I know that she has no more spears, so I engage her, and I use my health to secure that kill. What's Godlike mean? Did he break it? Ha! <laughs> the disrespect! You're actually about to see my classic REQ. That's my ult into arcane shift into my Q. Watch it destroy. That's my REQ right there. Are you satisfied, gods? Wreck! Wreck! It hurts, don't it? It hurts, bro. Mm, I can't. What's this dude dragon? Oh, I'm going up, I'm going up. Yep, I am too. The enemy team decides to engage my team because they thought that I was out of position. The Morgana ult is definitely helping in this situation. My team decides to engage them and continue to hunt them down like the dogs they are. Now the one thing I did want to focus in on this is at the end you're going to definitely see something that you need to work on. In games, if you see that your whole team just got destroyed, right? And either whether you make it back or you come back from being dead, do not go in by yourself. Do not. It's something that I see a lot of people doing. See here, we've got you. We've got this turret. Don't come near this turret. There is five people. This Lulu, for instance. Now we got a Q, my Q, my E. I've got it. Now I've got the turret and your kill. It's actually going to happen again. There's an Italy spear. That one actually really fucking hurt. Pisses me off. But people just keep on coming in thinking that they're going to do something. Morgana has her Q. I have my Q. Leeson has his Q. Now this Vladimir is pretty much done. See? Look! Over! Now we've got two kills. Oh wait, make that three. Now we've got three kills, an inhib, and a turret. When you could have just defended, we couldn't have pushed any further. I hope this helps. It's, it's definitely something that I see people doing, and I really want to focus in on that, because we, we can stop making dumb mistakes, guys. Let's win our games. But I mean, now here comes the plays. Uh, you're about to see a Nidalee Spear that um, is pretty fucking painful. But I survive. I've survived, and I... Turn around and ult, because I know that Darius can actually 1v8 their entire team. So I definitely help out to secure that Jax kill and then have to avoid a couple spears. But in the end, Nidalee can't catch me. I'm Ezreal. Get the fuck out of here. A quick helpful tip for the ADC against any people that think they're Trick 2G. Keep your distance. Always keep your distance. Always keep on poking. Look, I ult, then I flash, then I get him with my last Q. Oh, I missed that. Don't do it. He can kill you. I can't believe that fucking worked, dude. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the couple tips I gave you in this. If you want more of that, go ahead and let me know down below. <laughs> you see what I did there? Anyway, thank you so much again. Like this. Go and share it with your friends. And I cannot wait to see you on stream or in my next video, you sexy motherfuckers.